again. So it's been a bit since I've done a video. I do apologize. I've been very busy with work and other things going on. But I wanted to do a Halloween DIY. It's going to be a skull on a candlestick. So let's get right into the supplies. So what we're going to need is a candlestick. And I picked mine up at our thrift store for a dollar. Can you see? Yeah, it's a dollar. And it's pretty sturdy, pretty heavy. I also picked up this skull at Dollar Tree. And I went to the 99 cent store and I picked up a little hat. And let me open it so you can see what it looks like. Like this. And it has the little clips at the end here. Also at the 99 cent store, I picked up some of this feather boa in black. And then at Hobby Lobby, I picked up a little piece of this, um, what would it be, like these beads. And I paid $1.80 for this little piece right here. So it's going to be fairly reasonable. We're also going to use a couple of these rhinestones that I picked up at the Dollar Tree. Oh, and a glue gun and some scissors. So let's get started with this DIY. Okay, so the first thing you're going to do is, if you want to spray paint your candlestick, you can do so. I think I'm going to leave mine this color. And um, what we're going to do is we're going to grab our beads and I'm going to glue it around the rim. So you're going to pretty much glue it like this, okay? And then you're going to cut this off. So I'm just going to glue this right on with my glue gun. And I'm using a high temperature glue gun. Just go all the way around okay guys so it should look like this okay and this could be an, on any candlestick as long as it's round okay so now the next step is going to be I'm gonna put my candlestick to the side I'm gonna grab those rhinestones these right here and I'm gonna go ahead and glue them inside the eye socket so let's see See, probably gonna do a little dab of glue in there. So it looks like that. Okay, so now the next step is we're gonna grab our feather boa, set that to the side, grab your candlestick, and then you're kind of gonna go around the top here measure to see how how much of this you want on there I don't know maybe somewhere around there put your skull on top to look yeah I think that looks good right there so what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna go ahead and then glue the feather boa around the lip here of the candlestick just be careful not to burn your fingers Okay, so see now I glued it on. The feather boa is completely glued on all the way around. The next step is going to be to glue your skull onto your candlestick. So let's see. Yeah, I'm gonna put it right there. So I'm gonna set the glue right here at the base. So it's glued right there. Okay, you guys, I took off those clips that were on here, but you gotta be very, very careful on how you do them because they're really glued on there. So it kind of started to rip a little bit. So all I did was to cover it, cover it where I had these clips on there, was cover it with some feathers that I glued on there. So now the next step, you know what? I think actually I like it like that better. I'm gonna use the part where the bow is at and I'm gonna put it towards the front. Let's see. Yeah, just like that. And then I'm gonna glue this hat right on top of the skull. Okay, this is what she looks like when she's all done. So all I did was I added some little rhinestones all the way around 
the base of the candlestick I added more beaded fringe and I added more of the feather boa all the way around and her head is all glued and this is what it looks like when it is completely done and this is just an idea I don't know I mean you can add your own twist to it make it however you like use a different candlestick but this is what I had on, on hand and I tried to do it as cheap as possible so I hope you enjoyed this tutorial and you give this skull a try thanks for watching guys bye